You have to eat a cracker right now. Hello and welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, welcome! So today we are going to be doing a recent purchases video. So if you are interested to see what I've recently purchased in the past couple weeks, then please keep watching. So, I've purchased a lot of hair products and, well not a lot, I've purchased um, some hair products and some makeup products and clothing and shoes, so we're going to go over all of those things. So we are first going to start with the hair products. So I love Pravana Color so much. So they recently started carrying Pravana inside of Cosmo Profs, so I purchased the Intensive are the Intense Therapy Tree Extra Healing Mask by Pravana. So it looks like this. So this is supposed to be great for damaged hair. Um, I do have fine hair and I also have some previously lightened pieces. So when you see my green, that's Pravana green. Um, but that is also lightened pieces that I'm trying to cut all the way out of my hair. So those are previously lightened pieces that I'm trying to make sure that they do not break at all, especially with it being more dry out. So I definitely, I use this once and I absolutely love it so far. I also use Olaplex and then I have used the Moroccan oil, the light hair mask too. So I really like this so far. The next product by Pravana is going to be their Super Shape Hairspray. This is amazing. I'm so happy I found this. Um, I definitely don't like a sticky hairspray, but I like it to have a little bit of hold to it. And that's definitely what this does for me. So it says a styling mist for ultimate hold and humidity defense. So living in the Midwest, basically all of our seasons have somewhat of humidity besides winter, kind of. It depends on how it rains and everything. So that's why I have loved this so far. So this hairspray is 100% vegan and 100% gluten free. It's also sulfate free, salt free, and paraben free. So this is great for your hair. So I definitely recommend trying this out. It also has a little bit of volume to it too. So if you flip your hair forward and then spray it, and then you lift it back, then it leaves that volume. I think that's one of the things it actually says. So achieve every level of hold with this best-selling style perfecting hairspray lightly mist for a flexible hold or extend the spray for a stronger effect firm but flexible super shape hairspray adds tremendous body and always leaves a touchable finish so it does add volume to it the next thing i bought for my hair and my hair is actually in it is the wet brush pro so i have the normal wet brush um but i recently saw this one in cosmoprof and i was kind of wondering what the differences are the difference with this is it has a grip handle to where the normal wet brush does not so it's easier to hold it also has these little divots right here so that way when you're brushing you can put your fingers right through it actually i'm just gonna <laughs> Ever since I've started using a wet brush, I've definitely seen a huge difference in how much hair that I lose or that comes out in the brush. Using normal brushes, I'm like, I'm not tender headed, but I'm like, ow, this like hurts. It's really pulling on my hair. So if you have not tried a wet brush, these things are amazing. So this is the Pro Detangler. I have the box still. So some of the benefits it says, um, it's ultra soft Intel Flex. So that's a word that they have come up with. Bristles, um, over 45% less breakage, easy grip, rubberized handle, which is what I just pointed out was the difference. The next thing we are going to get into is some makeup that I've purchased. So um, I got these two items from Beautylish. I love ordering from Beautylish. They are amazing. So the first thing is going to be the Good Molecules Wake Up Eye Serum. And then this is what the product actually looks like. So it's formulated with caffeine and pumpkin extract to brighten, firm, and deep puff. So definitely with the weather doing what it's been doing here, um, I've 
woken up more swollen, more puffy and everything. So I really like this. I just started recently using it and I really like it. It's super lightweight under the eye and I can definitely tell a difference when I do use it. So it says that it can be used for morning and night. It has a dropper system and it's kind of almost like gelatinous -y. It's not really oily. So if you guys can see this. It just rubs right out and then it will dry down so I have really been loving that lately especially because I feel like the eyes are such a sensitive area finding something that definitely does what you need it to do is kind of hard sometimes so if you watched my last video you heard that I had purchased this palette so this is the Jeffree Star Thirsty palette um, I purchased this in honor of my sister Mark so I used it today. I just used a couple of like the neutral shades. I didn't really want to do anything too crazy. So this is what it looks like. It's such a beautiful palette. Like this top row, ugh, I'm living for. And then I'm excited to get into some of these shimmer shades as well. And then I really enjoyed this shade, this shade, and this shade. These two shades. Are definitely going to be out of my comfort zone but I'm gonna challenge myself to create a look with them so I cannot wait to play with this if you would like to see a first impressions on this palette then leave a comment below so the next two items are both from Lime Crime I got these at Riley Rose so the first one is going to be of course a diamond dew this is a diamond dew I do not own it is um, the Paris Diamond Dew. How many times can I say Diamond Dew in one sentence? So it has more of a pinky gold purpley look to it. You can see that. You know how much I love these liquid shadows. So I'm super excited to try this one. I think it would go really great with the Thirsty palette. So maybe I'll do a little little look with those two and then the next one I actually got for free from Riley Rose they were doing like you spent so much you got like a free little gift so it is the Lime Crime Velveteen in Shrub I tried it on earlier and like it was cute you know you can't beat free so this is kind of what it looks like I would say it's it's definitely like a pinky red. If you are familiar with MAC lipsticks, it looks like all fired up. Alrighty, and next we are going to get into some of the recent apparel I've purchased and shoes. So we're going to switch on over to that. Okay, we are now going to check out some of the apparel that I've recently purchased over the past month of February. Um, so... We are first going to start with some things that I have purchased from the Real Real. If you don't know what the Real Real is, I really suggest you look into it. It is a online consignment luxury shop. So they sell a bunch of like Louis Vuittons, shoes, off-white, a bunch of brands, a bunch of cool street brands. Um, and usually they're all marked down because they are gently used items. So the great thing is that they give you how the item looks. So it would be like it's in good condition, it's in moderate condition. If there are any flaws in the item, it'll have it listed so you can kind of see what you are getting yourself into. They typically always have a 20% off code and it's just the code REAL. Also, if you sign up and you join them, they give you $25 towards your first purchase. So I've been using this website since probably 2014. I absolutely love it. I've never been disappointed. If I do ever have to return an item, it's super easy. I just ship it back and they credit my um, card back. So yes, we're gonna start with the items I purchased from them first. I'm actually, I didn't purchase this one recently. I purchased this last fall. Um, it is Alexander Wang Adidas collab. So the first shirt I'll show you is actually Alexander Wang Adidas collab as well. So it's going to be the mesh polo. I'm obsessed with this so much. 
it's literally in perfect condition like there's nothing wrong with it um typically people will post like how many times it's been worn or if it just doesn't look like it's been worn at all and then the real real always puts these tags on their items it says an expert behind every item this item cannot be returned once tag is removed so they are inspected and then tagged once they are approved for sale the next item I purchased from The Real Real because I love crop tops just because I have a shorter torso, they tend to fit my body a little better. So this is going to be the Opening Ceremony Elastic Logo Top, also from The Real Real. I cannot wait to wear this. Ah. The next item I purchased are pants. So I do find it super difficult sometimes, at least for my body type, to find pants online. I always need to try them on first. There's a bug on my light. No. Mm. Oh my God, there it is. Go away. So it's always super difficult for me to purchase pants online because for my body type, I am more petite, I am curvy. Um, I need to try the item on to know how, exactly how it fits. So these are the I Am Gia Gwyn pants. So they have mesh, zippers, and then they have an elastic bottom too. So I do have another pair of I Am Gia pants. They are the Cobain black pants. Um, so I kind of had an idea of how these fit. I got a medium in the first ones that I had purchased. So I got a medium in these as well. I know that you always can't trust that if one pair of pants fits you from a brand that, you know, if you get the same size, the other ones will. But I feel like they're, they're pretty consistent, so. I'm excited to wear these, especially with the mesh. Oh, I love those kind of details. The next item I purchased is from Valfrey. Um, this is one of my favorite shops. I get a lot of my phone cases from them. I purchased some uh, sweatshirts from them as well. If you see a calendar hanging in the back of some of my videos, that is the 2019 Zodiac calendar from Valfrey. So they also launched t-shirts. So I am a Leo, and then on the back it has Leo, it has a description of what a Leo is, and then it also says the dates, um, July 22nd through August 23rd. This shirt is so soft, like so soft. Um, I actually just opened it today to film this video, it has been in the package, I have yet to wear it. But I'm just obsessed. This is currently like the screensaver to my phone right now as well. The next item that I purchased is actually from Poshmark. It is a Nasty Gal collab with JD Maria. And it is the denim, one of the denim jackets that they did together. So it says not your babe. And then it, at the bottom it says not your princess either. I love jackets and I just thought this was so cute. So I definitely love this. I have worn it once so far. The last three items are actually gifts from my boyfriend. Um, he went to All Star Weekend in Charlotte, North Carolina. So he brought me back some goodies. So the first one is going to be a Chinatown Market sweatshirt that he actually custom made for me. And it has my nickname on the hood, which is KK. And then he put small details on the sleeves as well. So I love a hoodie. So this is perfect. Thanks, babe. The next two items are shoes that he purchased for me as well. So the first ones are going to be the Jordan 1s. UNC pattern. I've worn these the past two days. I'm literally obsessed with them. And they match my nails. Love these so much. They are so cute. I love navy in anything. I wanted to pair the opening ceremony crop with them. And then the last pair is going to be um, Jordan 1 as well, the turbo green. So this is how these look. I have yet to wear these just because it's been raining. So he actually told me that they did not have these in my size and I was heartbroken because I'm obsessed with the color and just how they kind of look. They look a little distressed. They do come with two different laces. 
like color options. I'm gonna keep white just because I don't wanna be rocking Barney on my shoes. So yes, love these. Alrighty, so that is it for my recent purchase. Oh my gosh, I lied. That is not it. We have one more thing. Where are we? So the last item I have are actually by Key Australia. It is their blue light glasses. Um, this is the hard wire style. So they look like this. The lenses are probably dirty. So what's great about these is they help um, deflect any blue rays from entering your eye. So they're great to use while you're watching TV or on social media on your laptop. I'm prone to migraines, so I was definitely super excited to try these. I've worn them the past couple days and I definitely could tell a difference with how my eyes felt, if that makes sense. You know, sometimes certain lights strain your eyes. Um, so if you are a sufferer of migraines, I definitely recommend checking these out. I'm obsessed with them. They have a bunch of other different styles as well. Um, I just find these super cute because they're clear. They kind of dress up like your look if you are dressed more down. So I definitely recommend trying these. She is sold at Riley Rose. That's where I first saw those. Riley Rose, um, Nordstrom, there's a bunch of like different places that carry them. Also, I know Desi Perkins just launched a new blue light collab with them as well. So if you're interested in seeing that, I definitely would check that out. And mm, burp. All right, guys, so that is it for my recent purchases video. I hope you enjoyed seeing what I've been purchasing over the past couple weeks. Remember, if you are interested in seeing a first impressions slash look using the Jeffree Star Thirsty palette, leave a comment below. Remember to subscribe and like this video. Come back and visit me. Just be part of it. Just, just come on. It's good. Yeah, let's be a family, let's be friends. I thank you guys again always for supporting me and my YouTube journey, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.